everybody and welcome back to my channel. It has been a long time since I've posted, like a long time for me, it's been like three or four weeks and I haven't posted for various reasons but I will explain it all in this video. But first of all my hair is still a bit wet. I was gonna blow dry it and straighten it before this video but here we are. I've not done it, I can't be bothered. I couldn't even be bothered to do my makeup, but I thought, you know what, I'm just gonna do a little bit. I've actually done my nails for once as well, um, so yes. I am now in a new place. So basically, I made the decision that I wanted to move out of my old flat. If you didn't already know, I used to live in Lincoln, I was born in Lincoln, and I basically grew up in Lincoln and stayed there until I was about yeah, until I was 22. I was trying to think how old I was then. And basically, I just, I lived with my parents, with them for ages, and then I moved into a flat, which my dad actually was like the owner of, so he was my landlord, and I stayed there for about three years, just less than three years, and I really enjoyed it there. It was a cute little flat. It was nice i've shown you it on my channel like that's the flat that i filmed all my videos in for the past three years so you would have 100 percent seen it if you watched my videos but i made the decision i wanted to move closer to work because i was driving 50 minutes to get to work and 50 minutes back every single day so that is 50 minutes times two i should be good at maths because i studied accounting and finance at uni but i can't do that calculation no come on georgie come on is that one hour and 40 minutes? Do you know what I think it is? An hour and 40 minutes every day minimum to get to work. This is not, you know, the traffic will have been worse some days. So some days it would take me an hour. Some days it would take me an hour and a half, like genuinely depends on the traffic. Not often, but most of the time it was around 50 minutes. And to me, that is ridiculous in terms of the length of time I'm spent in a car driving. Like I didn't mind to start with because for me, I'd only just sort of passed my test in March and I was just practicing driving. Like it was excellent driving practice for me to keep driving every single day. And it has like, it built up my confidence driving fully and I'm really confident with driving now and that's great. But I just got so bored doing that journey, like 50 minutes, the same journey every single day and I kind of enjoyed like the journey into work because it was kind of like a relaxing drive in um and it just kind of woke me up a little bit into the day but the one on the way home like driving home I just couldn't be bothered like I just wanted a time machine well not a time machine but I just wanted to get from A to B in two seconds rather than 50 minutes and yeah, so I just thought, you know, I've had enough. And also it was costing me a lot of money. It was costing me roughly like £10 a day just to get to work. So that's £10 out of my wages for the day just to get to work. So, you know, I was willing to pay that and I was willing to do that because I wanted to live like in Lincoln. I liked it in Lincoln. I liked my flat and I was happy to pay it for like a month or so. But then time passed, you know, time and I suddenly thought, do you know what? I can't be bothered to drive. I can't be bothered to pay all this money or I don't want to pay all this money. I want to move. So here I am. I'm renting a new flat slash house. It is a house. Um, it's a small house, but it's nice. I like it. Um, it's actually, it is nice. Like the rooms are good. Like I'm in my bedroom right now and I love it. I love every single room. I will be filming a new house tour that will go up on my channel probably next week so I want to film that you know when I've got sort of most things sorted because at the minute I still don't have like a sofa I'm trying to sort things out it was unfurnished but yeah I really like love it here and I'm five minutes away from work I'm five minutes away from work so I can just come back here at lunch which I have done twice so it is genuinely amazing to live this close to work and it means that you know I won't be tired you know I, I actually feel so drained like driving so much and you know having to get up an hour earlier to get to work that kind of thing I don't have to do that anymore so I have a lot more energy I feel like when I finish work and I get back I still have energy to do things whereas when I used to get back to Lincoln after my long drive I would be quite drained I would just basically want to go to sleep straight away but 
I'm happy here. I really like it. I love the living room. There's like a nice little stove thing. I might insert, actually I won't. I was gonna say I might insert pictures, but I won't because I wanna show you in the tour. But yeah, so that will be really nice and cozy like in the winter months. The, the kitchen was not as good as the rest of the rooms, but it's still really nice and I still like it. And there's a lot of storage space for things in this house in general. The bathroom. I love the bathroom. I can't wait to show you the bathroom. I just really like it. There's a bath for starters and I, in my previous flat, didn't have a bath. So I could only ever have a bath if I stayed at my parents who, by the way, live only two minutes away from this flat. So that's handy. Um, and there's a shower as well. And yeah, I just love the bathroom. It's my favorite room and it's a lot of people's favorite room um, in this place when they've come and seen it. Then we have the bedroom, which I also really like. There's a lot of wardrobe space, um, as you can see, like along here as well. And yeah, it's really nice. The carpets are new, the walls have recently been painted and I just really like it. It feels like very clean, like a complete fresh start. So I can't wait to film some cleaning videos as well in this place. So they will be coming maybe next week. And yeah, I'm really excited. The garden is shared, so I do share with a couple of people, which is fine. I have my bunnies as well that I recently bought a few weeks ago. They are also outside in the garden in their hutch and they can run around a little bit outside and also um, I let them run around in the kitchen. I don't let them on the carpets because um, they, bless them, they do this thing where they think that a rug or a mat is a litter tray. So they will hold in their wheeze and poos when they're on like, you know, the kitchen floor or lino or whatever. But as soon as they see a bit of material, they're like, yes, that is where I am meant to pee and poo. So I'm not letting them on the carpet ever, but the kitchen is fine. Um, and outside is obviously fine. But yeah, so that's them too. And then also my hamster, Fertile, he's doing good. He's in the living room in his cage. But yeah, everything is really nice. There's loads of space, there's loads of storage. And I'm really happy where I live. And the most important thing for me is that I'm closer to work um, and my job, which I really enjoy my job. And I want to stay living here in this area. I do like the area. It's a lot more rural to what I was like previously experiencing in Lincoln. It, it's a city, so there's a lot of, you know, things going on and there's shops everywhere, there's cars everywhere. Whereas around here, there isn't really, you know, there is still a lot of things, but there's, it's not a city at all. Like it's a little village. Um, so it's quite cute and nice and I like it. So it's been nice to kind of settle in. I live right next to a pub. So um, yeah, I've only been there once though, since I've moved in. I've been moved in for about a week though. So I guess that's not bad. Um, but yeah, so I'm really happy where I'm living. I will do a tour. I'll probably show you it next week. I am hoping to be posting two videos a week. I think I can have time for. Um, I might get rid of my Sims series. I'll still keep the videos up, but let me know if you want me to carry on the series if you're actually watching. Um, but I've left it so long. That I think, you know, people might have forgotten what's actually happened in the series. So I might just scrap that series, but let me know, let me know. Um, so yeah, I've got loads of videos planned, tours, cleaning videos. Um, I'll do some makeup videos, some like favorites videos. I just wanna get back into like my old style of filming videos because I kind of lost passion for it and it just kind of went downhill. Um, and I think now I'm in a new place, I have like found, found my passion again for it. Um, but yeah, I don't think I've got anything else to update you on really. Like nothing else particularly has happened apart from this. Um, but yeah, apart from that, subscribe, please subscribe because I am going to be filming a lot more videos and putting a lot more effort into them. I want to film more cooking videos, like just general lifestyle videos. Let me know of any suggestions of anything that you want me to film. But yeah, so that's my little life update. If you was wondering where I was and why I've not been posting, I still don't have Wi Fi, so I'm, <laughs> I'm not doing good. <laughs> no, I, I. I got 10 gigabytes of data on my phone the other day and I've already used it all. So within two or three days, I've used 10 gigabytes on my phone. So that's not good, okay? <laughs> so I need to buy some more data, but only use it a little bit. Um, but yeah, I think we're gonna get, I think I'm gonna get Wi-Fi in a week or two, hopefully, fingers crossed. Um, because when you don't have Wi-Fi, 
you suddenly realize like how much you miss it and how much you actually rely on internet for everything um but thankfully my parents do live close so i can just go and use their wi-fi if i need to um but yeah so hopefully we can get that sorted but that is again another reason why i haven't been posting because i haven't had wi-fi to upload videos but i'm gonna go and upload this at my mum's okay and my dad's they live together but yeah so Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you in my next video. I'm not 100% sure what that is going to be, but it is going to be something. So yeah. Bye.